First at 11, heartbreak at Georgetown after a recent graduate student turned humanitarian is killed. Bess Rosenzweig and her mother were killed in a plane crash in Kenya. Jay Korf joins us live in Georgetown with more on her life and now her legacy. Jay. Austria friends described her as bright, adventurous, committed to helping others. This young woman perished in a place she was devoted to. Students arriving for another year at Georgetown University are hearing the heartbreaking news. A recent spring graduate, 22 year old Beth Rosenwig, recently perished in a plane crash while vacationing in Kenya. It's just so awful. I mean, I did a program that was abroad, like social justice kind of, and I can't imagine that happening to anyone I went with. At the time of the crash, Rosenwig was traveling with her mother, 48 year old Claire Klube. According to the Boston Globe, Rosenwig had traveled extensively throughout that region of Africa and planned on settling in South Africa to continue her passion, humanitarian outreach. Her goal was to work for an organization that uses arts education to inspire children living in extreme poverty. But nearing the end of her trip on July 25th, the small plane she was in crashed in the mountains of central Kenya, a few hours drive north of Nairobi. It took searchers days to find the wreckage. There were no survivors. Georgetown students Remy Cohen and Christine Nichols say they admire students like Rosenwig, committed to working on the ground with organizations that make a difference in people's lives. When you hear about somebody who had those plans, who was out there doing that, and then had something so tragic happen to them, it definitely makes you reevaluate things. Not, not that that's not what you want to do, but that things still happen even after you, know, you leave the bubble of school. And the cause of this airplane crash remains under investigation. Live outside the campus of Georgetown University, Jay Korf, ABC 7 News.